Hey guys, I know this video is going up super late, but I wanted to share a look that I was playing around with for Halloween. So if you guys are interested, keep watching. Starting off with a bare face, obviously, and I'm kind of just doing my normal makeup routine. I'm putting on a primer, and then I'm going to give myself a nice bronzed smoky eye. Since I am feline ferocious, I really want to play up the drama of the eyes and really just intensify them with the smoky look. And then I'm just going to continue with my normal makeup routine of applying my favorite BB cream and then I'm also going to conceal, cover up those dark circles and contour my face. I'm contouring this area to really sculpt my features and make them more cat-like. And of course this look would not be complete without a dramatic cat eye. Looking fierce! And since I am terrible at applying lashes, seriously, I'm just going to apply a crap load of mascara. And of course, I am going to line my waterline and just really intensify these eyes. Now for the fun part, I am just going to put a ton of spots in different directions, different sizes on one half of my face and these are going to be my leopard spots. And for the other side of my face, I'm actually just going to apply it in a small area, kind of on the side of my eye. And this, I just feel, makes it a fun look and kind of makes me part human, part leopard. Wow! Using my black glittery eyeliner, I am just going around and finalizing the shapes of my leopard spots. And the good news here is none of these need to be perfect because all leopard spots are all unique and different. a few more spots that I actually wanted to add some more so I just went ahead and did that before I went on to the other side. For the nose, I decided I actually wanted to make a heart shaped nose just to really make this just a fun, cutesy little look. Feeling pretty ferocious! This is literally going to be the only time it will be acceptable for me to use black eyeliner to outline my lips, but I really want to create this bold 
ombre lip and this is pretty much the only way to do it. I'm using this berry color to begin the transition of my ombre lip and then I'm going to go in with this more red color in the inner parts to really just bring it all together. You can choose to go without but I felt like this look had to be completed with a nice set of whiskers. Put your hair down, bust out that inner feline goddess, and bam! But hold up! It's unnecessary amount of selfies time. Do the duck lip. Smile with your eyes, girl. Give them fierce. Ooh, so ferocious. Oh my god, I'm so surprised for no reason. Rockstar status. Random peace sign and oh my god, I love Hello Kitty! Look how intense and seductive I am. Am I trying too damn hard face? Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Meow!